Hey, I'm Didi Bernard and this is Didi Dynamics. So today's video is about a journey that is about to start for me. I have decided to lock my hair. Yep, I decided to lock my hair. <laughs> I'm gonna tell you why. Yeah, I'm gonna watch the process over and over. Um, my hair are in, my hairs are in little twists. They have been in it for like a month, but I'm actually about to take these out because as you can see, I don't know if you can tell, it's more on this side than it is on this side. And it bothers me. Like, <laughs> I know like it shouldn't matter, but this is really bothering me that I can be like, Oh, I want to wear my hair like this, but this side I don't want to do it because there's not enough hair over there. So I am about to take all of these out and I'm going to wash my hair, condition my hair, and then twist it back up. When I did these, it took like six hours to do. Like six hours. So today is Sunday night, Sunday night. So I'm going to take them loose today, wash my hair tomorrow. And then probably twist it the next day. I don't fucking know. Because I still have to order the clips and the lock, a little gel, whatever. But I'm finna go ahead. Since I'm just sitting here, I'm about to go ahead and just take these shits out. I'm gonna miss my little babies. Look at her. They're so cute on this side. But then, yeah. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take these out. Like, the back is fine. But this one side just messed everything up. And I have to start over. So yeah, let's get started. Okay, so I am halfway done. Well, over halfway. I gotta pick out this little part. The little cute part. And I'll be done. So I am officially done taking this shit out. But damn, hair. That's one thing I'm gonna miss about like, it's my pros. Oh my God, my hair is so itchy. But yeah, I think this whole side is fucked up. But here it is. And I'm going to comb it out and everything and wash it onto you, bitch. It's one left. Hold on a second. And here we go. Got them all out. I checked, I double checked. So, yep. I'm going to wash it tomorrow. Okay, so now I've combed it out. And as you can see, it's a whole bunch of damage. And this is what came out for now. Like, so far, this is what came out. So, I'm going to hop in the shower and finna give it a wash. I'm going to wash it with Miel shampoo. Hold on a second. Okay, this is the one I use. It's probably going to be backwards with Miel, um, the pomegranate and honey one. I'm going to use this. I'm going to wash my hair twice. And then after that, I'm going to put the Rosemary Mint Strengthening Hair Mask. I don't know if it's relevant or needed. It's something to lock my hair, but might as well go ahead and let my hair breathe and comb through it for the last time. So... Let me go ahead and get in the shower and go wash this. Okay, so now it is washed. I washed it twice. Um, and it's super dry. Like, that's one of the reasons why I'm locking it up. I'm gonna get into more details about that. Um, later. But now I'm about to go in since it's so dry. But it's my last time seeing my fro. Well, whatever the fuck it's supposed to be. But yeah, like you can see the damage in the color. It's like a little, a little bit of my pattern is there. But like, it's a whole bunch of damage also, so. But now what I'm finna do is section it into six sections. I can actually show you what I do. Um, My hair has... What's it called when your hair gets dry real fast? Porosity, low porosity or some shit like that, whatever. Um, so I just get me a generous amount, like such. Uh, 
Let me do this. Give me a generous amount and just comb it through with my fingers. Come on, I mean, wipe it on the outside. That's, that wasn't enough. And then I hold it, get some more. And as you can see, it's already hydrating. Could you see the different colors or whatever? Not colors, curls, whatever. Because I have like three different hair types, hair textures. And then I just brush it through so it can be even. It's always safer to brush with these brushes vertically. But yeah. I do that. You see, then I, due to the fact that my hair is so short now, I just put it in the little bun as such. And I pin it up there. And voila. Wait, that's not right. Hold up. <laughs> Edit it up. Okay. Turn it around. Okay. That's not, that feels about right. Okay. Oh. Put that in there. And boom. Now I'm going to do the rest of my hair and I'll be back. Almost done. Oh my god. I'm going to miss my little curls. Y'all see when it get hydrated, it like starts. Ouch. Ouch. I'm just kidding. It doesn't hurt. <laughs> um, Y'all see when it gets like moisturized a little bit. That thing is on my bed. When it get moisturized a little bit, then my pattern comes up. Yep. I'm going to twist that. Now, I have the last one. Almost done. Home stretch. Home stretch. It's a lot of stuff. Anyways, rake it through so y'all can have a better view of it. I'll rake it on the outside first and then I'll rake it through as such. It's some good product because like I can literally just, as soon as you put it on, you can just slide your hand through that easy but I just um I brush it just to make sure everything is touched with the mask start from the bottom make a way to the top twist that Boom. And this is supposed to stay on for 15 to 20 minutes. I said minutes. <laughs> 15 to 20 minutes. And I'm going to do the full 20 since it's the last time. My hair being a little ball is like this freely. Um, and I'll be right back with the list of the things. The reasons why I'm locking my hair. Now what I'm doing is about to put the deep conditioner in. I don't know if it does anything due to the fact that I just put the mask in. So it probably will look. Well, that was a mask. They're probably, I don't know. I don't fucking know. Um, so I just put this on and do the same thing. Just put a generous amount on. But this time I'm not going to comb, I mean brush through. I'm just going to do it with my hands and not the brush. My hair is already drying up. Oh my God, this little porosity is no joke. Do that, put it in a little bun and... <sighs> Did y'all hear that loud bang in the background? I have a new cat and I guess she's exploring and seeing what can she get away with because... Okay, now I'm on the last one. 
You see it. You see it. I know you see it. Do the same thing. Comb it through my fingers. Make sure the outside gets love too. Get those ends. Boom. And this is supposed to stay on for hmm, 15 minutes. The mint condition. Pretty brown eyes. No. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna let this be in for 15 minutes and I will be right back with you. Now I have rinsed the mint condition. Pretty brown eyes er out my hair and here comes what I think is the hard part and the longest part because the last time I did it it was like six hours well including the washing and everything but it was at least two hours to get them completely correct okay so here's the last time I will see my hair at its natural state potentially this is the last time <sighs> i like doing this for some reason i usually put leave-in conditioner on it but i'm not going to because i can just put it on when i have the twist so i'm just gonna use it up for the last time there and I'm about to get started. So I finally got my first part somewhat even. So what I do is I use this gel, Eco Styler gel, and just put it on the section as such. Do it all the way across. I don't know if y'all can see it. Yeah, I'm going all the way across. And then that's when I do my twist. It's my first one. No, it is not. The parts between them are not going to be perfect. I just know the first time I... What are you doing, Zoe? The first time I did my twist, I had seven on the back row so i'm just going to keep that pattern it was seven eight eleven and then that's when it got discombobulated but yeah twist that oh shit don't want to work okay i twist that and then have put some gel on the end to coil the twist in place to coil the twist in place can't see if it's okay that's coil so boom one twist down i don't know how many more to go but yeah i'll be back i am halfway done i had to put the top in like three ponytails or three buns because i have to go to practice and i completely lost track of time so yeah, I'm gonna be late for practice, but like we have a game tomorrow. So, but I, when I get back, I will do the other half. I would show y'all, but like I already put the head on tight and secure. Hopefully, it stays on. If not, hopefully, no one sees it. <laughs> okay, so I'm on the way back home. These are dry. Um, when I get home, I'm gonna immediately start on it. So I'm hang yourself with. Okay, y'all, I am almost done. I just have this section left. Um, I'm about to go walk my dog, Carlos, and I will get back and finish it up. Of course, they're different sizes, but I mean, like, 
I don't care at this point because I'm just ready to get over with. So yeah. And I also made them smaller. Accidentally made them smaller. So yep. There's the moon. There's Jupiter. Don't see Saturn tonight. That may be it right over there. Well, there's Jupiter. I don't see Saturn, but yeah. Okay, I am finally done. It's a little puffy right here because it's wet, but that'll be solved when I do a retwist and do the little clamp thingies and whatever. But here is the final results. If I change it, I'll let y'all know. This is how much hair I lost. Breakage. But, um, yeah, so this is it. I should do the back. Hold on. Oh, no. I can't really bend down because my knee, <laughs> I injured my knee. But, um, here's the back. If you saw it, if not, I'm sorry. And that is the finished result in Zobalog's journey begins. Bye!